Hi everyone, this is Ayşenur Altan. We are making Turkish style stuffed cabbage rolls lahana sarması. Stuffed cabbage rolls are a popular and traditional dish in Turkey. We have different recipes but mostly we have two varieties. First with ground meat and vegan version without meat as an olive oil dish. In this episode I will make it with ground beef and spices and with extra tomato garlic sauce. It's a perfect dish for cold winter. So let's get started. I have one and a half cup plus one tablespoon bulgur wheat and one and a half cup of rice. You can use only rice if you like. I'm also going to use big handful of parsley and one teaspoon each black pepper, paprika, salt and allspice, two medium sized onion, four cloves of garlic, one tablespoon each tomato and red pepper paste, 250 grams ground beef and one medium sized cabbage. Try to choose the softer one. Usually we have two types, one for making pickles and one for sarma. They give you when you ask them. I'm gonna take out the outer leaves and going to cut the stem part so I can get the leaves easily. And here on stove top I'm boiling plenty full of water on my uh, biggest pan and now I'm going to uh, boil the leaves until they are soft. It can change depends on the cabbage but we are looking for uh, easy to roll uh, softness. Uh, don't overcook otherwise it will tear off and you're not going to be able to roll it. So each time I'm going to uh, cook like two three leaves depends on the size and as you can see the close to the stem side of the leaves are uh, harder and thicker so I cut them to use to make pickles and continue to uh, cook the leaves. Before we continue to the recipe I have an announcement to make. I'm making a contest to give away free Turkish online cooking class. What I want you to do is to like and comment under this video saying why are you following me and what's your favorite dish. The online cooking class will be this Saturday live. We're gonna cook together. I will announce the winner on Friday under this video. So make sure to check. You can also see the details what I'm gonna cook in the links on my website turkishfoodtravel.com I also have one contest on my Instagram page. You can enter from there too to double your chance. So good luck and let's continue to the recipe. It takes about four minutes to cook leaves but it's better to, as I said, try it to roll it until it is soft enough and then drain well. I'm gonna roll some of the filling with grape leaves so I didn't boil all of it and kept the thick part of the cabbage for pickling. So for the filling I'm gonna dice finely two medium sized onion. I have big handful of parsley. You can even use half a bunch. It really makes it more flavorful and colorful. Finely chopping four cloves of garlic. It's up to you how much you want to use. And here goes the uh, washed and drained bulgur and rice. Bulgur is more healthier choice than rice and also has a denser flavor. Uh, if you try you will understand but still you can use only rice if you like. Adding the tomato and red pepper paste along with the spices 
and now I'm gonna mix everything well until it is incorporated I also added about third of a cup water in order to make the rolls soft and rich in flavor we need some fat so it is better to use like at least 20% fat on meat but you can also drizzle some more olive oil to give more extra taste I have everything ready on the table along with my coffee and I'm gonna begin to roll now we have big cabbage leaves so we have to cut them into reasonable sizes that you can fill easily and roll once or twice maybe other than that it will be too thick and let me show you closer you see the veins in order to roll it easily you have to put the filling along with the veins and then it will be much more easier and will look pretty add generously from the filling a fold from the sides and then roll I'm going to cut the excess I'm using white pan this way it will probably make uh, two layers and they will cook more evenly if you have a thick part you can cut that out again and continue to roll I'm gonna show you one more leaf because it has big stems in the middle so I cut it like so and then uh, separate two sides again uh, cutting into reasonable size I just cut it in into half and continue to roll you can use the excess part of the uh, cabbage cooked cabbage to make some soups or other recipes or place them in the bottom of the pan and then uh, stack the cabbage rolls I have some more filling left and I'm gonna roll them into grape leaves which I pickled in the season and I have the recipe you can also make it's really practical way to keep it year long and then you have a filling left you, you can just take out some of the grape leaves and then roll it to make sarma and then you cook them both together it really gives their taste to each other and makes it even more delicious so my dolmas or salma, sarmas are ready I just need to make extra sauce to make it even more tastier and for that I just heated up some olive oil and sauteed one tablespoon tomato paste along with two cloves of garlic and about one and a half cups of hot water after it is hot enough you just drizzle all over the dolmas and add more hot water until it reaches somewhat to top layer don't full all the way up and to give some sourness to my dolma I added some citric acid which we call lemon salt limon tuzu you can pour lemon juice if you like or pomegranate molasses maybe but it's not traditionally used in this version I just wanted to show you but uh, it's optional and cooked my lahana sarması until the filling and the leaves are soft for about 50 minutes to one hour and make sure to let it rest in the pan for uh, 20 minutes at least and it will be ready to serve we usually eat plain yogurt 
you can drizzle over the dolmas but uh, as i said in the beginning it's really a healthy delicious very flavorful winter dish with the bulgur all the spices meat and the taste of cabbage and grape leaves if you are using so give it a try this version and let me know how it turned out thanks for watching i hope to see you in another delicious turkish food recipes and travel vlogs afiyet olsun